What's happening guys, Safety Liner C2 here. For those of you who saw it yesterday, yes, this is a different video. Um, slightly different video. So, um, yeah, today we are doing a first look of a 2008 um, Bluebird Vision, as you can probably see, made by Concord. And this bus is going to be private, as far as I'm aware. Um, but, yeah. So, there are um, a couple things that are wrong with this bus if you, um, you know, just, yeah. <laughs> um, but, as far as I'm aware, they um, will be fixed. So, let's go ahead, let's take a look. Um, I like the addition of the Bluebird mud flaps. Those are pretty nifty. Um, there we go, there's all the sounds. Um, Shut down the bus if I can. There we go. I don't know if that's the. Okay. Let's see, where am I? I need to be over here. Okay. So, let's take a look. Like I said, I like the addition of the Bluebird mud flaps. Um gap between the door right now oops wrong wrong button it seems that this uh, thing to hold the the uh, cover down is missing a little bit let's see the crossing gate is just a little bit off um, no school bus sign up there these are just pictures, I can tell that. Um, some of you guys think this looks like GCPS's hood. As far as I'm aware, they work together on this hood, so um, either one of you two can correct me down below. Um, let's see, stop sign already in there, but I'm sure that's just something that I can press backspace on. Um, would have liked to seen maybe a separate battery box down here instead of them right on top of each other, you know. Um, let's see, what else? Maybe some side lettering would be nice. Once again, no school bus sign on this back door. I would have liked to seen the little handle. Let's go ahead and let's hop in the bus. That's the pick, that's the wheel. Um, Okay, not not too bad. Uh, not liking the white seat, but emergency equipment, first aid kit, walking devices, no standees. Um, we'll see what's over there with free cam in a minute once we take a look. Um, I don't know the steering wheel. I mean, I like the texture of it, but um, it just doesn't really fit in well with everything else. Here, so um, let's see if that parking brake works. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Um, let's see, there are gauges right there. Hopefully, those will work. So once we once the startup, okay. Let's go ahead and start it up. Okay. Oops, let's put it in. Okay, let's look around. Turn to open and close. Ooh. Attention to detail, gotta give him credit for that. Um, he said there is high idle on this bus, which is F9, but I would demonstrate that. But F9 is my recording stop, uh, start and stop button. 
so that's not going to happen. I would have liked to seen it cover right here, um, right here, to, with a handle on it, you know. But all right, let's check out some flares. Ooh, we get a this side in the middle. Interesting. Let's get a bunch of different views. So let's let's check those out again. We get driver. Uh, let's see, this is the first seat. We get the last seat. We get the middle seat. And then we get the first seat. Or maybe this is the second seat, I can't tell. Okay, well, well still. Um, and then, last seat. So, um, end lights are on. I don't recall pushing the end lights. Flares are a little bit off. Um, there we go. Those look good, actually. The warning lights. Uh, not so much on the back. Turn on the reds. There they go. Let's put on the four ways. Classic bluebird back or uh, turn signal. Let's check. And horn. Just a standard horn. Let's check the door. The stop sign. Um, yeah. That could be a problem. Turn that off. So annoying for me. Um, click T, see if there's anything else. Nope. Alright, let's drive. Oops, I kept on pushing the start and stop button. As much as I like those camera angles, just trying to get to this view where I am now was, you know, slightly difficult because I'm only used to having a couple camera angles. But, you know, I don't think every single angle was necessary, but I do like the time put into it. See how difficult that can get. Alright. Okay. We can live with that. test. I know we can, but how it will do, you know. Left actually isn't that bad, but um, initial thoughts on this bus? It's not bad. Yeah, it has its flaws. The flaws are, are big flaws, but I think what he uh, um, has completed and is done is good. So if he puts the time into this bus um, to fix all those major things like um, 
like the door back here and that door remove that back stop sign that isn't there or add a stop sign um, then this can be a pretty good bus I don't um, I, I think it's good so would have liked to see maybe a bluebird logo up here that's always nice but um, yeah so let me know what you guys think about this uh, down below uh, yeah and that that's pretty much it so uh, thanks for watching make sure you subscribe right down here it's a magical red button that says you want to subscribe to safety line or c2 make sure you comment up here down here or over here or over here i don't know where they put it down and where they put it make sure you also give this video a thumbs up or this will happen to you and make sure you also share this video with a friend show it to your mom show it to your dad show it to a guy in a random street i don't care don't get raped so uh, yeah guys thanks for watching